Hey everybody, this is Doe with another StarCraft II Procast for you here. I've got uh, Hope Torture, as you can see in the lower left part of the map on Shakuras Plateau here. And his opponent is going to be this guy. Okay, so here we go. Alright, this translates, this name translates as Siu Yanji, which I did some research on because I hadn't really heard of that player before. And Siu Yanji is the name, and I'm probably pronouncing that terribly, but it's the name of uh, Stargirl, who is a StarCraft 1 commentator, I believe. I don't think this is her, though. I came across an article where Boxer said he practiced with uh, Zhang Yang Su, who goes by the name Siu Yanji on uh, Battle.net. And of course, uh, Zhang Yang Su, if you don't know, is also known as Lots Prime. So this may be Lots Prime or Lotsy Prime, depending on how you want, want to pronounce it. But since I'm not totally sure, I'm just going to say Seo Yanji. And everyone who actually uh, can speak Korean and hears me is probably going to laugh, but I'm going to do it anyway. So we've got Hope Torture versus uh, Seo Yanji on Shakura's Plateau. And uh, this map you haven't seen a whole lot yet. It's uh, a relatively new map in the ladder for StarCraft 2. We see uh, Hope Torture putting out his first barracks. So let's go get that production tab up there. Uh, the interesting thing about this map, actually it's got a lot of interesting things in it. Um, first of all, these two bases, you've got the rocks here, then a short walk, a little base, rocks, and you're in your opponent's base, so really short rush distance if you break down those rocks. You also have, uh, you know, semi-protected naturals, although you do have the cliff up here as well. The, uh, the regular natural expansion for both bases, or all four bases I should say, is fairly well protected. You've even got a ramp here and a ramp here as well. So when you're talking about Terrans, you can park the siege tanks up on this cliff here and get a really good view of your opponent trying to come into your base. Uh, one thing I do like about this map is that there are no gold expansions. I'm not a huge fan of those, so I'm kind of glad to see a map that doesn't contain those. At least I don't believe it does. Yeah, these aren't golds. These are just kind of a mirror of the southern part of the map. So yeah, another TVT, and I promise you the next cast I do is not going to be TVT. I've casted quite a few of those, and I want to try to do something <laughs> something different someday. So uh, both players looks like getting their orbital commands. Things looking very similar starting out. Uh, both players actually saving up minerals from what I can see here. So yeah, we may have a uh, dual fast expo here Don't going the uh, one racks fast expand. I don't see a gas for either player yet too, so... Yeah, it looks like uh, they're both going to go fast expand, which makes sense. It's not a bad idea on this map, as your natural is so protected. And uh, the rush distance from here to here is fairly long. It's a pretty large map. And uh, this early in the game, of course, you don't need to worry about your rocks being you know, taken out in most cases. So we'll have to see uh, what the players decide to do with that. A couple of Marines moving out across the map for Hope Torture here. He's going to take a look at the Zelnaga Tower for just a second just to poke in to try to find where his opponent is and I think he's gonna find him fairly quickly looks like the SCV for uh, oh boy so Yanji I'm probably pronouncing that terribly coming back uh, to his main here and it looks like Hope Torture does find him but that SCV does go down so a little bit of an early loss there for Hope Torture that's never something that you want to happen you want to at least be able to get in and do some scouting uh, Hope Torture putting up a protective bunker at the ramp of his natural in the meantime, looks like he has put down his second and third barracks. I'm guessing that uh, Seo Young Ji will be doing that as well. Yep, second and third barracks going down for him. This is a fairly standard Terran fast expand opening. You get the first barracks in your command center, then you put down two more barracks and start pumping out mass marines, usually in most cases. Um, usually you do see a bunker here. We saw Hope Torture putting his bunker down, but it looks like Seo Young Ji is not doing that. The uh, command centers for both players just finishing now. Actually, Hope Torture is finished a little bit earlier, and he is floating that over. Both players getting there about the same time. Some SCVs being transferred down. We see Stim being researched by uh, Seo Young Ji. Oh, I'm sorry, by Hope Torture. I don't really want to say the other name any more than I have to, so I, I should be more careful with that. <laughs> and we do have a reactor going down on a barracks for Hope Torture and Seo Young Ji, or Red Terran. Both gas is going down as well for Hope Torture's opponent and for Hope Torture himself, so really both builds basically identical right now with the exception of Stim being researched by Hope Torture, so we'll have to see if that plays into things a little bit later in the match. So G just uh, producing a lot of Marines at this point, Hope Torture does scan and he will see these Marines, but not a whole lot else, I believe these barracks are just out of range of that scan. Scan of course having a much larger range than, range than you actually see on the screen. We see uh, Seo Young G getting Stim Pack now, so he will be stimming up with mass marines as well, but that stim is going to be much later than it is for Hope Torture, which may give Hope Torture a little bit of an advantage when he pushes in initially. Factory going down as well for both players right now. 
So we'll have to see what they transition at this point into. Uh, Shakura's Plateau is a map I think that uh, I've noticed tanks can be kind of abused on, especially with these uh, these uh, bushes here. They of course prevent vision, so you can pull the tanks up right here, fly a medevac or something like that over, maybe poke a marine or two over and get vision over these other areas, which can be pretty helpful when you're trying to gain control of the middle part of that map. Uh, second reactor going down on the third barracks for Xiaoyangji. So it looks like he's going to be really pumping out a lot of marines, and we do have a small force going across the map for Hope Torture. Just Marines at this point, although Stim did just finish, so a little bit of a timing push involving Stim for Hope Torture. We're going to have to see if this does any damage at all. Let's see how well defended So Young Ji is, and he has a lot of Marines, so that's going to be, I don't think this is going to be really a problem at all. Uh, yeah, Hope Torture actually shouldn't attack this 23 to 18 Marines, so at this point this would be a, kind of a big loss for Hope Torture. He is going to push in, scans and sees some Marines, and he will pull back. Good move by Hope Torture there, not... Not any reason to throw away your forces so early in the match. In the meantime, let's take a look again at Hope Torture's base. We do have the engineering going, engineering bay down, but no upgrades quite yet for the uh, damage or... I almost said care pace, but I meant to say armor for the marines there. Uh, do have two more gases going down at the natural of Hope Torture. No gas yet, and I take it back. Gas just finally going down for Xiaoyun Ji. So Hope Torture a little bit quicker on the second gas there, or the gas rather for the second base. And if we take a look around the base here, we see another barracks coming out, so fourth barracks for our Red Terran here. Let's take a look at the income tab for a second. We have both players about even 45 over 44, so you G in just a little bit of an early lead there. SCV is going to be pushed away from the Zelnaga Cavern by Seo Young Ji. And it looks like uh, Red Terran Friend is putting up a hidden expansion here up at the uh, 2 o'clock position. So one of the other main bases, uh, one of the other main base spawning points that is on the map, as well as he is moving across the map with his marines, taking a little bit of control in the center of the map, but he is pulling back a little bit now. You can really utilize these bushes to uh, create lots of problems involving vision for your opponent. A few marines going down, they're going to take out this marine first LNG and regain control of the Zelnaga Tower. These two marines running away, stimming. That's kind of an interesting choice there. Going to join the rest of the forces as well. One Marine stimming in to take out this Marine, but it looks like that's not going to work. In the meantime, we do have Medivacs out for Xiaoyang Ji, leaving one Marine here to take the Zelnaga Tower. And the Red Terran will pull back, adding more Marines to his forces. Let's go to that unit counting station. We do have a tank coming out now as well. And is Siege being researched? It is, in fact. It is a little over halfway done. Looks like Seogyong Ji planning on doing some sort of a drop, I would guess, at the main of Hope Torture, possibly thinking of sneaking around this back area here and uh, coming in the main from kind of an awkward angle to defend, although Hope Torture does have this supply depot there spotting for him as well, although this may also be to keep an eye on those rocks. In the meanwhile, we do have a, a force massing for Seogyong Ji. In the middle of the map, we have a few Marauders adding to the Marines. Marauders, of course, are good if your opponent is going tanks, which it looks like Hope Torture is. Some tanks already sieged on that cliff there, with a couple more spotting up on this upper cliff. This is a, a really, really great place to put siege tanks, as that your opponent, of course, if they are attacking from ground, has to go up through sort of a gauntlet of death to get to your tanks. Uh, looks like concussive shells also being researched for Hope Torture which is a little bit of an in interesting choice there. Tanks already aren't really the fastest, so I'm not terribly sure why he'd be resour resourcing that. Researching that. Uh, gas going down at the hidden base for Seo Young Ji. Transferring a few SCVs up there, it looks like. And we do have Seo Young Ji pondering whether he wants to drop or not. He's really thinking about it. He's been flying those medevacs around a little bit, and it looks like he is going to drop as well as we do have an army coming in the front for Seo Young Ji, so it's going to be a double-pronged attack, although Hope Torture did just take down the rocks, so that's just bad timing for Seo Young Ji, bringing his forces in right at that point, that drop would have been taken out earlier. It looks like he is going to push in at the natural of Hope Torture, two tanks immediately going down with the siege tank up on the higher ledge, two siege tanks able to shell the opponents from afar. Hope Torture moving down the ramp with his mass marine group, and it looks like Hope Torture is going to be able to hold this off. Siege tanks able to take out the tanks of his opponent. Hope Torture pulling back, which is a, a smart decision. Looks like we did have a drop going down on the siege tanks on the high ground as well, so a nice move there by Soyoung Ji. He was able to take out a few tanks. Hope Torture forced down into the natural. But it looks like he is going to be able to hold off this attack. Let's take a look at the army size there. 
Uh, this medevac may go down for Shyoga and G. Army size still about even, so despite both players losing a lot of forces in that attack, things are still about the same, although that extra income is going to let Seoyoung Ji uh, get a little bit of an edge up in replenishing his forces. Looks like Hope Torch are taking this opportunity to move across the map. As we see, he is also putting up a third base himself, although that is much later than his opponents. And here is where those bushes may come into effect here. Medivac's giving vision to the tank, where Hope Torture cannot see the forces of his opponent. Hope Torture pushing in, but he does pull back. And uh, Sir Young Ji in a great position right now to shell his opponents, although the, he does not want to lose those medevacs to the Marines of Hope Torture. 